All right, again, this this one is a strip teaser that was written back in like 96 or 97. Um, Anti-strip joints, nudie bars. Um, it was written on my Fender Stratocaster that was in standard E with the six string drop down to D, which was drop D tuning. So this is a standard E. This is a low E. So this is um, strip teaser uh, played on played much lower. Turn up a teeny bit. Originally, I was going. But that's just because I was singing the verses. Now that I'm obviously not going to be singing. Uh, I still write lyrics, but I don't want to be singing. Um, I thought, i got to come up with something else. This is kind of boring. So a couple years ago, I came up with... Um, After that, I, in the middle of the song, I wanted a completely different drum beat. I don't know how to describe. Actually, I do know how to describe it. ACDC song "The Jack" has a boom, boom, ka, boom, 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 ka, boom, boom. Kind of like the striptease classic beat. Um, That's the beat I wanted in the middle of this song. Like, I wanted the song, the tempo change, to be the classic striptease blues beat. Boom, ka, boom, 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 ka, boom, boom. So then. It's a lot different now that I'm on an 8-string. Hmm. Yeah, I'm playing it a bit, a bit different now that I'm on an 8-string. Um, but i got to keep in mind that... Uh, boom, boom, ka, boom, 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 ka. Boom is the kick drum with the foot. Ka is the snare. I, I, I can't beatbox, so I can't go, you know, t -t 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 with the uh, with the hi-hat or the ding 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 with the riding cymbal. But when I'm, when I'm going boom, boom, ka, boom, boom, or boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, boom, ka, the bum 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 is always the bass drum in my head, and the ka is the snare. Bum 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 ka bum 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 ka.
goes, oh, baby, uh, something dance for me, and it just, yeah, um, And I liked in a lot of songs how when the tempo starts to pick up again, the, the singer always goes, go! So when we recorded this song, I do, I, I say, go! But we were off by about two, three seconds. So it's supposed to go... Um, In the actual verse, original tempo of the song was supposed to increase. We were supposed to play faster. As soon as I said, go, I wanted the whole band to just go. One, we were off about two or three seconds. So I went, go. So me, after I said go, the tempo of the song did not increase, and we were off for about two or three seconds. We were only in the studio for 10 hours. We didn't have the time, because we couldn't afford it, we didn't have the time to correct that tempo change. So I, again, wanted to go right from... To a faster pace but again like I said as soon as I finished that that one riff and I went go we were about two three seconds off so it didn't sound right after I said go because we came into didn't come in on time and the tempo didn't increase we stayed at the same uh, tempo and it's I'm a strong a lot of people say that the drums and the bass are the backbone for the band and I it's just my opinion I'm a strong believer that the drums drive the band. If the drums are going boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka, you start strumming in that speed. The te like you go, it's almost like a click track. Boom, ka, 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 boom, ka. So if you're going boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka, boom, ka, it doesn't sound right. I feel that the drums keep the band in time. A lot of people say, no, 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 it's the guitar player. No, it's the singer. I strongly believe it's the uh, the drummer. Uh, everyone's home. I got to stop now.